Hey, this is a quick tutorial on how to use and install gradient maps. The way you make a gradient map is by going to your layers tab here and on the bottom there's this little black and white circle. That's your adjustment layers and then down at the bottom we've got a gradient map. We click on the thumbnail preview of the gradient here and we get our gradient editor. The import button here will open up a file browser and just select wherever that GRD file is and it'll bring up uh, the gradients in a in a little folder down here. And you can see, here's all of them. Uh, it, the thing that I love about gradient maps is that you can kind of just like click through them and see different results. So we can find one that we like for this piece and change the blending mode to soft light. And we can blend those colors in. While it's on soft light, we can also go in here and uh, we can click through and see how each of these are going to look with that blending mode attached. Uh, the reason I love gradient maps so much is because it allows me to really quickly flip through and experiment with a whole bunch of different color options to find something funky and weird, something that I wouldn't have discovered on my own. It, when I do the shorts, it looks like I'm just picking something because I know what's going to happen. They're really good for playing around and experimenting and trying out a bunch of different stuff. One final trick you might want to know is that you can see the adjustment layer here comes with a mask attached to it. If we use the gradient tool, we set it to black and white, um, and then we just paint on top of the layer here, we can actually mask that gradient off to be just part of the canvas. And this is really good for creating colors that kind of gradate uh, and change over the length of the canvas. I hope this was useful. Have fun. Good luck. If you want to get my gradients, go ahead and look in the link in the description. They're free on my Gumroad. All right, goodbye.